Hey, welcome to the Android channel and today is a quick video. If you're wondering how do I put my, uh, I, my Android phone or device into a more secure mode, uh, be it a tablet, be it a phone, maybe you want to have security enhanced or enabled so that nobody can really check out what you are doing with your phone or if you have really sensitive or personal data. Today's phones are really really personal. We put everything in there. We have our whole life in there. So we don't want anyone to just access our phone or our Android devices. So what you do is you go into the settings of your phone. Now here I have a settings panel. If you don't see it, search for the little dots that will actually help you get more apps you have to look you see on the upper right side of my screen here just out is little dots and you can see it here you search for that in your device and click on it and it will bring you the full list of uh, devices of apps and um, all sorts of enhanced security stuff is in here so what you do is you actually search for your settings they could be like a pinwheel like a little settings like this it can be um, also like here I have a settings which is really pretty much um, a square that says settings so whatever you have as an icon for settings uh, click on it but it's very often a pinwheel that you can uh, find go into the list of your settings and you'll see in the personal section if you have it if not just search for security and you'll click on that now in the security screen you have possibility of nothing or you can have slide this is why when you turn on your phone you have to slide to unlock but the best way is to have pin enabled so what you do is you enter a choose a pin number like uh, on your a credit card or debit card um, and it has to be something that you'll remember easily but what's cool about that is that it's gonna give you um, when you try to access your device um, it'll it's gonna ask you for that pin number basically and if you don't know it well you can't access the device so you can enter any pin you want but you know be intelligent with your pin number just don't put only like you know one two three four one two three four five that's not a real good one or you know zero 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 or you know just repetitive number put a good one and uh, once you've put your pin number all you have to do is click next you'll be asked for the pin number a second time to make sure that you know your pin and that you entered it right and once that is done, every time you'll turn on your phone, you'll have that pin that's going to be asked. And if you don't have it, you can't access your phone. So this is going to give you an added security on your Android device. Um, it's important if you, you know, have a tendency to leave your device uh, unattended for a certain period of times, or you know, if you get it stolen, at least you'll have a minimum of security. Uh, it won't prevent anyone that um, wants to really see what's in your phone to see it, but it'll prevent day-to-day uh, -day, uh, ordinary people that you know stumble on your phone to uh, either use it or see uh, any data that you have on it. So security, search for that in your settings on your Android device and uh, on the screen lock you'll click pin you can also put password which is a word so here you'll type in whatever password that you want click next it's going to ask you the password again and uh, that's another way of doing it if you prefer having a password instead of a uh, pin number uh, but they'll have both the same security so whatever you choose pin or password it could be a pattern if you want to try to draw a pattern on your screen 
Um, I'm not fond of that type of security. I'm more into pins or passwords. Uh, just make sure that what you choose is not easy for anyone around you to uh, find out. That's the most important thing. If you enjoy Android videos, well, click the subscribe button and you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions on what you've seen, hey, let us know. And maybe you have a Android feature of your own that you'd like us to talk about. Please let us know and we'll try to put that video online for you. And so thanks for watching and uh, hope you come back to this Android channel. Bye-bye.